Hey everyone, it's Saruke, and today we're doing Art Supply Roulette, and we only have two mediums left. Uh, pretty much the same medium, it's one watercolor and one watercolor pencil. Uh, I've added blank slips to the wheel because it's going to take forever to pick. So pink ones are the Schmincke watercolors, and the green ones, eh, yeah, they're green, uh, are the Stettler Aquarel pencils. So I'm just going to give this a spin and we'll see what we end up with. Green! So, Stettler Aquarels. Uh, I'm gonna get those out. Okay, so... Here they are, my aqua pencils. It's nice to see that I've actually used them because these are... They're probably my first um, real art supply quotations. Um, they are by Settler. Uh, it's a student quality uh, art supply that I really like. It's a water soluble pencil, so a watercolor pencil. This is what it looks like. I'm sorry about the shadow there. Not much I can do about that. Um, it's the Carrot Aquarels. Aquarel. Ugh. And I bought them in a set of 36. So it was a hell and a half to make this. A swatch sheet because you only get the number on the pencil. So I had to go to Stettler's homepage, look up the number, and then find the name of the color. Um, but this is what they look like. I Okay, it is hours later and I've finally figured out what I want to do. I couldn't figure out what I wanted to draw so I hung out on YouTube for a while and I saw that Zoe how do you pronounce your last name? I want to say Mariner, but that feels like I'm putting an R where there shouldn't be one. Either who, they posted... Maybe not recently, I just picked. Um, I just, I'm so behind on my YouTube videos. Um, but they had posted another create a character with the help of Instagram thing, and uh, I got inspired to do that myself because that, that sounds like it's going to be fun. Uh, Except that means I have to wait for the results. So in the meantime, I'm just going to do a quick randomizer myself of the results and do like for this video. So it's not so much about the character uh, because it's it's supposed to be about these pencils because it's the art supply roulette, not the create a character with Instagram. So uh, I used random.org to randomize the results. a female masculine presenting furry uh, who has natural hair color that is quite curly they're cute with no tattoos <laughs> but they have some piercings uh, their color palette is warm their body type is slightly on the slightly heavier than average they're kind of tan and they have short hair that hair one should have gone up there um, well, yeah, so I'm gonna get to doodling in uh, some ideas. A cute boy. <laughs> cute girl boy. Mm, cute tomboy? This is gonna be interesting. I like that they got short hair though, because that sort of serves the masculine presenting thing. Uh, not that you can't be masculine with long hair, but it helps me. It helps me. <laughs> Let's see. Eyelashes instantly make my characters look so girly, so I think I'm gonna do the the Yoda thing and just give uh, I just give her um, eyeliner. I am currently battling myself when it comes to um, uh, profiles or rather heads in general because I've noticed I do them wrong and I don't know when this started happening and it's just in general very frustrating because I used to be good at this and now I'm not. Is an undercut too cool? Nah. An undercut can be cute. 
Oh, she is adorable. Your hair is supposed to be curly. I already forgot that. <laughs> okay. How do we make your hair curly? Thank you. 
I'm actually going to call this finished. I know I didn't even shade the thing they're sitting on, but that's going to have to be okay. She needs a name. Um, I do think now that she looks a lot more like a boy than I intended, and I'm very tempted to put some more eyelashes on her, but then again, she is presenting male. She was supposed to look like a boy, and she does, so I'm going to be okay with it. Uh, post turned out great, but I'm a little bit sad that I sort of... Uh, abandoned the undercut because I really like the undercut. I should have just turned her head a little bit more to the well, her right, my left, and uh, made it more visible. Um, overall, I think it's it turned out cute. Um, and she needs a name. I also need some highlights. I haven't even touched that. It's because the media is still wet. Um, these pens are pretty good. You definitely need a lot of pigment to get them working. Because they are a uh, student art supply, there is a little bit more filler than there is uh, pigment in these pens. So you do need to help them out a bit. Um, they are also very soluble. Uh, so. Um, they liquefy really easily, but, um, they don't really, I don't know, I think it's because of the filler content, like the, um, the amount of chalk or whatever there is, the binder. Uh, you can see here on the black, the way it dries, it gets a lot of hard edges, and... Uh, I'm going to defend it by saying I haven't used the, these in quite a while, so it could just be me not quite working them the way I should. Um, layering is really easy if you let the bottom layer dry first. Um, and picking pigment off the pen, like that, is really easy. And uh, it works really well for layering. Um, they re-wet really easily, so it's kind of hard to glaze, but... Uh, as long as your brush is pretty dry, you can get quite a lot of detail into the drawing. I'm going to put a signature down. And still thinking about her name. Maybe I should just sign it in the SIG one again. I really liked uh, using this pen. It's 2019. I actually haven't dated a picture wrong yet. And because I say that, I'm going to do it. Uh, um, but yeah, she turned out cute. Let's see, she's a bunny. Usagi. <laughs> um, I want her name to be Caroline. Caroline. There we go. There we go. New OC. Don't know what I'm supposed to do with her, but she's new. Uh, might be able to stick her in. Ooh! Maybe I can add her to... Oh my gosh! My rulers are escaping. Maybe I can add her to... Um, uh, Ichiban Idol. Because there are only four characters in Ichiban Idol. Uh, so maybe she can get a role there. That would be cool. What would she be? Um, because there's like... There's the idols, there are the managers, there are the stylists, and stuff like that. So... Um, Oh, maybe she's a dance teacher. She could be like a dance teacher. It's kind of dumb that her name is Caroline now because, well, she could uh, she could migrate. She could have migrated. Like she she's she got hired by SSP. Okay, I need to write this down. <laughs> okay, so um, let's see. Caroline something or other. She doesn't have a last name yet. She's 20-something. 20, 20, well, 25 plus at least. Um, she is a dance slash choreo teacher at SS 
Sunshine Productions. I think I changed their names recently. Sunshine Entertain. Hmm. I'll have to look that up. She is um, dance choreographer teacher at SSP. Caroline, 25. Ichiban Idol. Ichiban Idol. So I know. Uh, I guess she could be involved in the Soul Project. Involved in Soul Project. And if, well, basically that was a, a group project. Venus was in together with Haruki, or Queen. Uh, Queen and Venus were in that project before um, before Venus joined Mars as Andromeda Effect, and Queen actually stayed with the project and debuted as a member of Soul. So, um, yes, okay, we have a dance teacher for Ichiban Idol. So whenever I start writing those stories again, I have one less character I need to develop. <laughs> She turned out cute. She's really cute. She's really cool. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Uh, this was the 13th episode of Art Supply Roulette. We have one left and it's going to be Schminke watercolors because that's the only thing there is left to do. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Please do if you haven't. Wow. Oh my gosh, I fell into my old, um, my old outro spiel. That was, that was weird. Anyway, if you haven't, go check out my giveaway that is currently running. It will run till the end of February, so February 28th. Uh, in that giveaway, you can win some Winsor Newton pigment markers and some marker pads to go along with that. So go check that out. You enter via Rafflecopter, and uh, there will be one lucky winner at the end of this month. So yeah, until next time, keep on scribbling, friends. Bye bye. I am living a Scandinavian monkey today, I realize. Oh my gosh, I I'll blame my cold. I don't say baby yet anymore. I used to do that over on... At least I haven't said what's up, people. It's the Scandinavian monkey. At least I didn't do that. That's, that's good. I